Good afternoon, children. Now, in today's class, we will learn mathematical calculations in logo. Now, in this mathematical calculation, we are having two types of calculation. Now, calculation with operators and calculation using commands. Now, let's learn calculation using operators. Now, you can see there are so many functions given. The functions are addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division. You can see that each mathematical operators having different symbols plus minus multiplication sign and division sign but as we are using the logo operators few of the sign changes like addition will be plus sign only subtra subtraction will be minus sign only but the multiplication sign changes to asterisk and the division sign changes to backslash sign now let us see the formats of different operators now we can see that addition using plus operator you can add two or more numbers using the plus sign operator now the format here is show number one plus number two plus number three it shows that as the num digits you are having the different numbers you can write the it has number 1, number 2 and number 3 and then you have to press the enter sign and enter key and then you are going to execute the sum. Next is the subtraction. In subtraction again we are having the minus sign. You can subtract number using the minus operator. The format here is given. We have to show number 1 minus number 2 minus number 3. In number 1, number 2 and number 3, it shows that you can write the number as given in the question as shown in the example. Now let us discuss the operator that is multiplication. Now you can multiply two or more numbers using the asterisk sign operator. You can see the format show number 1 asterisk sign is given then number 2 again the sign is given then number 3 and then press the enter key and and this is how you are going to execute the multiplication operator. Next is the division operator. Now you can see the format of the division operator. You can divide the first number by the second number using the backslash operator sign. So by seeing the format you can understand that we have to write number 1 that is the that is 100 which is shown in the example which is divided by 20 and thus you are getting the output as the result. Now let's discuss calculation using commands. Now while using these commands you can see that here the function addition, subtraction, multiplication and division is written. But the logo command we have to write s addition for addition we have to write sum sum. For subtraction we have to write difference. For multiplication we have to write product and for division we have to write quotient or remainder. Now let's discuss the addition of command. Now you can add two or more numbers using the sum command. Format is show sum number 1, number 2, number 3 then you have to press the enter key. Example you can see that to add three numbers 10, 20 and 30 show in bracket they have written sum 10, 20, 30 and then press the enter key and you are going to get the result. Next is the subtraction command. You can subtract two numbers using the difference command. As you can see in the format that show under bracket we have to write difference and the number given in the question. Now to subtract two numbers 50 and 30 the format as given show and under bracket difference 50 and 30 and you have to press the enter key and the output as a result we are getting 20. Now next is the multiplication command. You can see in the multiplication command two or more numbers using the product we have to use this command. Now for the format of multiplication you can see show under bracket product number 1, number 2, number 3 and then close the bracket and press enter key and the example has shown here that we have to multiply numbers you can see that show under bracket product 10 space 20 space 30 bracket close and enter key is pressed. And this is how you are going to get the result outputs 6000. So this is how we are going to execute this format. 
class we are having the division command now in division command you can divide the first number by the second using the quotient command and can get the quotient as a result or output so suppose you are asked to find the quotient so you will put the format show under bracket quotient number one number two close the bracket and the key pressed should be pressed and then you are get, going to get the output so now for the remainder command also we are going to get the format we can see here show under bracket remainder number one number two close the bracket press the enter key and you are going to get the remainder so whenever you are going to get the question as find the quotient you will use the quotient format and to find the remainder you are going to use the remainder format